It's about 11.14 at night. I'm James Langford. Want to be able to give you a quick update. I'm in McAllen, Texas, literally right at the Texas-Mexico uh, uh, border. This is one of the underground processing areas that has been set up literally under a bridge. This is a bridge that moves from Mexico into the United States. Uh, this is where families are actually coming uh, and unaccompanied minors will just show up here during the night. And like I said, it's about 11.14 at night right now. Uh, they'll show up. Uh, I'll kind of turn around here so you can see it. Uh, that far end down there, the bright spot, that's Mexico right down there. They'll show up down that spot. They'll be able to walk through. They're picked up by Border Patrol here. They're organized. They get their name, their information. They'll go through a very basic screening where basically they're asked, uh, do you feel well uh, kind of thing with a basic screening. They'll get their name and information. If they have a child that's uh, six years old or younger uh, or they're unaccompanied minor, but they can have like 10 people together that all say they're family. And if they have one child that's uh, five or six years old, uh, then all these folks will be released tonight into McAllen, Texas. Literally within a, a couple of hours from when they walk up from Mexico, uh, they'll go through the basic processing here, and all these folks will be released uh, into into the United States tonight uh, with what's called a notice to appear. It's a piece of paperwork saying you've got to show up at a court hearing. Uh, some of those court hearings are three years later, uh, so literally they're into the country for the next three years. Uh, so they'll walk up way down there, uh, they'll come through some basic processing here and you can see i don't know how many are here right now and then there's buses here at the end and uh, those buses will take them into the central part of McC uh, mcallen texas and uh, they'll just be released at a bus station from there and they can go anywhere in the country uh, that they want to be able to go uh, with that update this is the problem this is one of the areas that the media is not allowed to be able to come into that's why i wanted to be able to be here to be able to see it and say this is the thing that biden does not want you to see is that literally people walk across the border, they check in here, and they are all released. 100% of the people that are here tonight will be released. So this is absolutely an open border situation. Anyone who wants to come in from any country in the world, if you walk onto this bridge here in McAllen, Texas, on the Mexico side of it and get here and you pay the cartels to actually come up to this area, so the cartels make you pay a fee to be able to come here, on the, on the Mexico side, then they come in here and they're all released. So no matter what your background is, no matter who you are, if you come through this spot right here, you're going to be released. This is what open borders really looks like, and this is why this is a problem, and it's why I wanted to be able to be here tonight. We're going to spend the rest of the evening trying to be able to track what's happening in this area, and so people can get a chance to be able to see actually what's happening in this area, what the Biden team will not allow people to be able to see.